Hello everyone, welcome to the Engineering Projects YouTube channel. In the previous tutorial, we have created the SQL statement by which we fetch the list of messages and populate it in this data table. Here you can see we have date, which is invalid to understand. We need to convert that into the human understandable statement. This time is called Unix timestamp or Epix timestamp. We need to convert that into our own timestamp. So for that, first we will split this information and extract only this numeric value. And then we will pass this numeric value which is in the seconds to the JS function which is called date which return us the current date upon these seconds <coughs> so we are going to create our function <coughs> we are converting unix time <coughs> here we have time okay where my time is equal First, we will separate this time value. Here you can see we have this parenthesis and this parenthesis. So first we will separate by this parenthesis and we get two chunks. In the zero we have this and in the one we have this value. So we need one. After that, we will split this value on the behalf of this parenthesis. So we will get zero, this numeric, and one, this. Again, we are going to split. Now here we need a zero. This value or this statement will return us the string value which we need to convert into the int because the date method is not able to understand string so we need to create my time is equal new date and here we have parse int in this method we will return this string and it will return the value here return return is equal to this oh oops uh, we don't need is equal so this will return the value now we will use this method here simply cut and paste and now we will refresh our screen and here you will see we have this standard time if you need to show uh, the time upon your requirements such as you said you need to show first date then month then years and then seconds and so on etc things you can do that too uh, <coughs> uh, here you can see I have a simple uh, date time and I'm going to pass this in a new date new this and I will say two uh, or here we have here you can see how it look like the time is changed now even that we can say two day or simple get date and it will get us date get year and it will give us the year and get uh, month or full year you can whatever you can wa uh, need it you can do that easily with these built-in functions to represent the date i hope this is informative if you have any kind of question you can ask us and don't forget to subscribe the Engineering Projects YouTube channel. Take care. Bye-bye. Have fun.